Hello friends, welcome to another video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can update your TP-Link routers firmware at home. So firstly, you'll have to go to download center of TP-Link, uh, link to which I have given in the description of this video. Here you will have to keep a drive as all and for model number, you'll have to check um, the model number of your TP-Link router. So firstly, you can uh, enter the login URL of the TP-Link router and here uh, you can hover over the tab and see the model number. And the second uh, method is uh, checking the backside of your router. You can just uh, <coughs> check the backside of your router and check the model number as shown in the image. Okay. Then I will just note it from this uh, tab. So uh, my router's model number is TL WR740N V7. Okay. So keep it keep it in mind v7 is the version of the hardware so you will have to check the version as well on the back side of the router so enter this um, model number over here and i will choose my model then here you will have to go down and click on firmware then sc scroll down and <coughs> scroll down and read this uh, information which is given here it is just uh, given that you will have to disconnect your internet from your router while updating the firmware as well as uh, you will have to use lan cable uh, instead of using wi-fi for updating the firmware okay so these are some instructions given over, given over here uh, i have downloaded the firmware from uh, that link and uh, after downloading you will have to uh, log into your router so enter the password and uh, id and password as admin and log into the router once you are logged in, uh, you will have to go to system tools. Okay. In system tools, uh, click on firmware, firmware upgrade. Okay. Here you will have to choose the file uh, for the upgrade. Click on choose file. Okay. So you will have to choose this uh, bin file type. Uh, bin file type you can see in the uh, type. It is a bin file. So you will have to choose this file. After choosing the file, just click on upgrade. Click on OK. And as you can see, the firmware upgrade has started. It will take few minutes. Oh, I'm fast forwarding it. After completing this, uh, the system will reboot and restart. OK, so it is restarting Soft software upgraded successfully as you can see so that's it for this video guys if you like it please give it a thumbs up and uh, comment your suggestions and subscribe to my channel thank you very much